The eight most mysterious cat behaviors. The cat is one of the most misunderstood animals in existence, and this certainly extends to their behaviors as well. It's no secret that we love our feline friends and treat them like a part of the family. But how much do we really know about their inner workings? From their grooming habits to how they communicate with each other, there are a number of strange behaviors exhibited by cats that many of us don't understand, but which can be explained once we know more about the role of their senses in their lives and how they perceive their surroundings. Why do cats always land on their feet? When a cat falls from a great height, he lands on his feet. This is known as his writing reflex. He does not have to use any energy when making these corrections. It is innate for him to do so. It allows cats to survive situations where they fall from trees or high places and ensures that they don't break their necks in doing so. While humans don't possess this ability, we can learn from it. Why do cats purr? Have you ever noticed your cat purring? You may have thought it was a cute sound, but there's actually something unique about that purr. Cats are unique in their tendency to purr for no particular reason. But what does it mean? Purring can have various meanings, so let's dig into how cats use their purrs in a few different scenarios. Why do cats pee on dirty laundry? The idea of your cat peeing on your dirty laundry sounds shocking, but it's really not that surprising. Unlike dogs that mark their territory by urinating on corners or fence posts, cats have no such psychological need to leave their mark. Your cat is a clean and self-sufficient creature, so he probably doesn't want to soil his own bed with urine. So where else can he go? The laundry pile in your room. Why do cats fight so much with dogs? Cats aren't typically aggressive towards dogs, but they are territorial and may feel threatened by a strange dog in their home. If a cat is scared of your dog, she may hiss, growl, or swat at him. She might even use her claws to defend herself. However, fighting won't solve anything. It can injure your cat or lead to serious fights that leave you with injured pets who need veterinary attention. Why do cats chase their tails? A common sight in any home with felines is that of a cat going after its tail. A lot of feline behavior is driven by instinct, so it can be hard to determine what's prompting your kitty to do something that you don't understand. A good place to start in understanding your cat's actions is at his or her base. How did he or she come into being? Why do some cats howl at night? Cats have a nocturnal nature, which is why many people find their meows waking them up in the middle of the night rather than in broad daylight. While it can be frustrating to be woken up by your cat's frequent howling, there is actually a good reason behind their behavior. They are hunting. The nighttime hours are prime time for felines because many of their natural prey are most active at that time, including mice and voles. Why are they called fur balls? Cats have hair balls because they groom themselves regularly, and when they do, they ingest a lot of fur. This fur then has to pass through their digestive system, which results in hair balls. If you're noticing more cat fur on your floor than usual, it's likely that your cat is suffering from a hairball problem. The best way to manage your cat's hairball problem is to provide them with plenty of space to play and scratch. Why do cats suffer from bad breath? The reason cats suffer from bad breath is because of an enzyme deficiency in their saliva. They are unable to digest and break down proteins, which end up building on their teeth and in their mouths. To prevent bad breath, offer your kitty frequent brushing or Opt for canned food if you're concerned about his dental health. Brushing should be done with a cat toothbrush, as human brushes aren't soft enough. Once you brush your cat's teeth daily for two weeks, it will become routine. Just remember to give him a little bit of time to get used to it. And be sure not to brush too hard. You don't want to damage his gums or tongue. As with humans, bacteria and plaque causes cavities and periodontal disease that can lead to tooth loss over time. Thank you.